Today we're leaving. Yeah, we. <laughs> oh. Big Meadow RV Park in Townsend, Tennessee and heading off to the International Rally in Lebanon, Tennessee. A three hour drive or about a three hour drive so not too bad. Yeah this has been a okay campground. Um, it's a little on the pricier side. It was $75 a night which is, I was a little shocked when I saw that because it was one of those ones where you look online and they didn't exactly tell you the price until you book it and then I booked it and I go what? So it was a little more expensive than I thought, uh, but it was okay. It was a nice quiet area. Like Randy said, for the price, you would expect a little bit more. They do have evening activities to participate in. Unfortunately, they don't have a pool, but they yeah. do have a lazy river ride. Right, right next door. Attraction right next door. With a real river, not a ride. Uh, yeah, right. And um, the sites are all concrete. So, yeah. so that's a nice feature. And it's full hookups. Yeah, so. yeah they're all full hookups. They have cable TV. Um, you're up just a couple miles from the Great Smoky um, Mountains National Park. We attempted to go in there and ride the, um, what was it, the... K Cades Cove. Cades Cove Loop. Uh, Wednesdays it's close to vehicle traffic and so we were going to do it on our bikes. And we screwed up using the GPS, went the wrong direction. And by the time we got there the parking was full and we missed out on it. So and, I'm a little disappointed about that. And that's every Wednesday. So yeah. that, that would be a fun thing to do. Yeah. And uh, like I said, they do have the Lazy River. It is a paid attraction, so it's about not- About 20 bucks. Right, about 20 bucks for a one day pass. Yeah. And um, you're not too far from Pigeon Forge. No, you're only about uh, 15 miles from Pigeon Forge. There are a few restaurants and shops in this town, but it's not really very big. No. And if you're looking for ice cream, you have to drive to, I think it's... Marysville. Marysville. Yeah, because the one ice cream place in this town didn't have ice cream. Right. Plus, <laughs> a lot of the local attractions tend to close about 7 o'clock in the evening. Yeah. Yep. So, it's the pretty day. But it was a nice visit, so we're off to International, and... Um, yeah, so this is where we're going to end this video. If you enjoyed this, what should they do? Subscribe to our channel, Zephyr's Travels. Um, hit the bell for notifications um, so we know you like the video. And leave us a comment and give us a big thumbs up. If you like the video. If you like the video, right. Right. So for now, we will see you probably during or after the International Rail. Right. So we will see you down the road. See you down the road. All right, bye. bye.